Hello everybody, how's everyone doing today? It is August 1st, 2023 in beautiful Big Bear Lake, California. We are getting our last day of the monsoonal flow for now. And I don't see anything on the radar in the next 10 days after this, so I'm a little disappointed, but hopefully uh, it does pick up again. How's everyone doing today? We also have my beautiful wife with us today. Dogs. And the two cutie pies right here. Luna. Baby. Luna, say hi. Say hi, baby. <laughs> She's so cute. You and Theo. Hi, baby. Theo, say what up, dude. What up, hi, buddy. <laughs> hi, buddy. Okay, so just started drizzling a bit. Today's storms are not supposed to be as intense as they originally were predicted, so I'm a bit disappointed, but however, you never know because a couple days ago when we did the first monsoonal flow in some time, um, when I was done recording and uploading the video, it got really heavy and there was nothing on the radar. So that's, that was super frustrating. So I'm, I'm just hoping that we do catch something, maybe some, some good lightning up here, but we'll see. I've heard a couple clasps of, of thunder, the type of thunder that sounds like it's just flowing through the center of, of the clouds so yeah I, I'm hoping we get uh, some good stuff but not not counting on it to be honest but yeah we're heading over towards Bear Mountain right now look at how beautiful the golf course looks look at how green that is that golf course is a lot of fun pretty much every hole there for all you golfers there's a, a beautiful view Big, a big beautiful backdrop of mountains. It's, it's just, it's really, really pretty. A little bit pricey for a nine hole golf course. I think they charge 45 during the week and 60 or something on the weekends. So it's not cheap. And I'm still not famous enough up here to uh, have them say, hey, why don't you come golf for free? And I'll never ask. So, you know, I don't mind paying. It costs, a costs you know a lot of money that I don't want to be using because I could be using it for bills and stuff but it takes a lot of my stress away kind of like riding my Harley but they do have packages you can buy like a 10 round pass for I think 250 bucks or or something like that and 10 rounds means just 10 times around the nine holes so it's not 18 holes 10 times so it's yeah I think that's that's where they get you. <laughs> but anyway, we're driving by Bear right now, as you can see. I'm trying to get us underneath the heaviest part of this storm, or at least what looks to be, and it's definitely over that, that way right there. Because if you look out here, it's, it's, it's more scattered over there. But either way, it's still beautiful and nice to have this out here and to have that the name of the... Uh, of that smell of rain, petrocolo, that's what it's called. I said it correctly, as far as you know, petrocolo, petroquire, or petrocore, petroquire. <laughs> told you guys I wasn't gonna be able to remember. I mean, I've you guys have told me a million times what it is, but I cannot, cannot remember. Hey babe, do you know what the smell of rain is called? Um, the smell of rain? The scent that comes from from a fresh rain? Yes, I do. What's it called? Petrichor. Did you, you just looked it up, didn't you? No. Let me see your phone. You just exited it. <laughs> You're such a cheater. She's <laughs> such a cheater. <laughs> you guys should have seen his face, though. When I was, I I was shocked. I was like, no way. His like, jaw slightly <laughs> dropped a little. <laughs> Couldn't believe it. <laughs> I also know that the word comes from the Greek phrase Petra. <laughs> Interesting. Wow, babe, you're really smart. Meaning stone, which in Greek mythology refers to the golden fluid that flows in the veins of the immortals. Ah, I didn't realize I had golden fluid flowing through my veins. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a Greek god, babe. I'm a, I'm a Greek tumor. He's a tumor. Alright, another view of our beautiful golf course. 
I mean, just look at how green that is and peaceful and serene. I feel bad for the rain for, for these guys out here, but it is what it is. It's so light that it, it's, it's gotta be really, really nice. So yeah, anyway, this isn't gonna be too long of a video. Not like the past couple days, because we don't really have much going on up here right now. And as I said, we were supposed to get a lot more, but it's just not happening. It's just not happening. Tiger. All right, here's the zoo. Hopefully, some of you have hit the zoo up when you come up here. It's a fun little spot. I like the fact that it's a brand new zoo, but I like the old zoo better. It it just felt like it was more of a natural environment for these animals because it was underneath a canopy of trees this new one it's just everything's in the wide open I kind of feel a little bit bad for some of the animals but they built really good you know uh, I don't know what you would call them pet houses <laughs> or, or homes for the animals in there to make them as comfortable as they can so that's good and again that zoo is a really great zoo because they aren't there to exploit the animals 100%. They're there to take in injured animals and they rehab rehabilitate them and then they let them back out into the wild if they deem it uh, possible for it to survive. And so. I think that they said that they don't, they don't release the bears. The bears are there to stay. Okay, that's too bad giant animals like that stuck in the, in their little I mean it's not the smallest enclosure but for an animal that size it is a pretty small enclosure when they're used to just being out everywhere but yeah look at this we're getting some pretty good rain right here we're, we're gonna go check out one of my favorite spots to look at these storms it's over behind Vaughn's so I'm, I'm excited to see what everything's gonna look like Hopefully we make this light. We got it. We got it. We got it. What are you guys doing? Theo, say hi, bud. Luna, what are you doing? Oh, you want to come over with dad? Come on. Come here. Come here, Luna. Come here, baby. Oh, oh. oh that's my girl. That's my girl. doctor's offices. I need to go in there because uh, I haven't had a regular checkup in years. Yikes. And I'm worried, worried, worried. Not that I have any real serious issues I can feel, but you know, I've been someone who went to the doctors at least twice per year for all my life and just to do maintenance and stuff like that. But since I'm not in any pain about anything, if I did develop something bad at least it's probably at a point where it's early enough to treat but I need to get my butt in there all right let's see here what's with you who with you Theo what's wrong dude <laughs> what's wrong big fella I think you're sick what's wrong the being in my car yeah babe it's yeah you should leave them with me okay done okay can you handle it of course I can all right, so we are turning left here, and as I said, this is my little favorite spot to get a nice open view of the mountains, and, uh, oops, what's wrong with my car? And yeah, just where that truck is in front of us, we're gonna turn around and uh, just kind of park along the curb there to get the view behind us. Yeah, we're just gonna keep going this way for a minute. 
So the mountains we're looking at is the Holcomb Valley area. And as a matter of fact, I think in the next couple days, guys, we're gonna drive up there and do a Holcomb video. Hope you guys enjoy that. If they let us. It's open. Yeah, it's, it's, it's long been open. It's been open for over a month now. Yeah, it does. And we're not gonna get stuck in snow again, babe. So that's gonna be great. Yeah. That was horrible. Backing out of that, it was scary. Okay, so this is the view I'm talking about. I love this view. And that's the view of? That's the view of Snow Summit right there and Bear Mountain. And then that tall peak is Sugarloaf Mountain. took a snapshot of them both standing out, looking out over this uh, really tall grass area. That is a really, really pretty view though. So again, that's looking out towards Holcomb Valley over there. Then as we pan around and come over here, that's where you'll start to see Snow Summit right there. So let me just zoom in right there. There you go, there's Summit. What a beautiful thing. So anyway, hang on guys. This was just gonna be a quick update for you guys to see what's going on. It's gonna all end in the next hour, supposedly. But yeah, we are done with this video for now. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it wasn't a long video and nothing too special, but we're getting this nice bit of rain here. And our town needs it. I suppose we'd get some of the super heavy, 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 heavy stuff, but that's probably for another day. Look at those thunderheads out there. Wow. All right. I'm going to say bye to you guys right now. Say bye to the doggies. Say bye to Theo, Luna. Theo, Luna. Say bye. Say bye. Bye, you guys. He's so <laughs> <bummed out. laughs> Babe. Bye, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, or not as always, because I only started asking you guys to like and subscribe last year. After seven years of never asking you guys once, please like, subscribe, hook it up, share the videos. You know, it'd be nice to see this channel kind of grow, especially because it's something I'm passionate about. It's not a job to me at all. So to have success doing something that you love to do is a bit rare these days. And I just want to make the most of it that I can. So thank you guys again for everything. Love you very much. And we will talk to you all later. Peace out. August 1st, 2023.